Hello everyone, I'm Jason Leader. I'm a digital artist and technical director. It's early February, 2024, and I'm here to give a brief overview of the recent collaboration I worked on with Cesar Emanuel Perez. This was for the Live Code Boston event presented last month by Boston Tech Poetics at MIT's Theater Arts Building in Cambridge, Massachusetts. Playing behind me is footage of the project for this event, we produced a series of animations that blended Caesar's original paintings and digital art with Unreal Engine 5 and glitch animation techniques. I have a lot to share, so I'll get right into it. If you're not familiar with Boston Tech Poetics, they're a creative tech community in the Boston area. I was grateful to receive an invitation to perform and share their open call to tech artists for the Live Code Boston event happening at MIT's Theater Arts Building in Cambridge. I believe this was my first time participating in a Live Code event. It was really cool to learn about all the amazing work being done in Boston and all over by technical creatives. I'm really in love with the arts and I especially love digital art. I immediately wanted to reach out to Caesar. This is him discussing his work and our collaborations. Here we have some of my canvas work um, at a solo show that I had last year. Some of the digital work that I presented while I was there as well. Me and Jason, like his collaborative work has always been super fluid. So I've never hesitated when it came to collaborating with him when it comes to anything. Um, so when he told me that he can take a lot of my 2D pieces and like bring them into the digital world, it was a no, like that was also a no brainer for me because I've always had this vision in mind of bringing what we do here in the physical world into that like virtual reality world and create these worlds where like we have colorful backgrounds, we have like virtual reality galleries where we may create these mini worlds where everybody kind of can be who they want to be, how they want to be. And then he introduced me to this live code event and I was like, yeah, man, let's go for it. Show, let's definitely show them some of the projections that we've been working on and some of the different visuals that we have to offer and things of that nature. I was very inspired by a collaborative piece Caesar and I did using Unreal Engine back in 2020. Here we combined some of Caesar's collage work with some of my digital fashion characters that were rendered using Unreal Engine 4. Mm, something. With the release of Unreal Engine 5 and Substrate, I wanted to expand upon our previous work and see what kind of beautiful materials and animations we could create. Substrate is the new materials authoring tool inside Unreal Engine 5.3. It allows for the multi-layering of textures that can be used in fun ways to make materials from artworks. Here's an inside look at Caesar's painting, creating a beautiful material using substrate inside Unreal Engine 5. I really like designing using no networks, and it's so cool to see artworks reimagined using these new digital tools. With Caesar's artworks creating materials in the Unreal level sequences set up, it was time to start rendering some videos and blend them up digitally. The live code event was going to feature a glitch aesthetic, so I processed the resulting renders using After Effects and Touch Designer networks. We uploaded the final videos and were glad to hear when our pieces were accepted into the show. The Boston Tech Poetics, Live Code Boston, and MIT Theater Building teams put an immense amount of planning and work into this event and it really showed. The night featured over 30 contributing artists, live audio-visual performances, and many unique digital artworks displayed in a variety of ways. Something like 350 people attended and donations were pooled and given to participating artists. Showing new work is always one of my favorite parts in the creative and design process. Here's footage of our final pieces being projected on the night of the event. It's such a great feeling to see people dancing in front of a completed project and enjoying themselves. A huge congratulations to everyone involved in the Live Code Boston event. I really appreciate all the hard work that went into the night and had such a great time performing and seeing all the amazing work. I for one can't wait to see what they do next and I hope you'll consider following and supporting their work in any way you can. If you want to connect with Life Code Boston or Boston Tech Poetics, their links are here. If you have any questions for me about this or other projects, I'm available to connect on LinkedIn or Instagram. That's all for now, and I hope you have a great evening.